Yahoo is basically giving over their most prized possession, their Yodel. Yahoo calls this hip hop. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's do it. So the Yodel Studio event in New York is going to be massive. Walking by and uh, I came in, went inside there and yodeled and ended up on the big screen in Times Square. Music's biggest stars here today helping you become the star. My role today is mentoring um, all the yodelers that are coming through here. I think Yahoo's giving the Yahoo Yodel back. You could be the new voice of Yahoo.com and it's all for a good cause. Ten dollars you get if you come in here. And take a minute to uh, get dressed up. Become your own yodeler. Yeah. We're just taking normal people off the streets with a dream and giving them the opportunity of a lifetime. <laughs> This is a way for people to really get their shot at fame. They have props that they can dress up. They really are being creative. They get to choose from all different genres of music for their yodel, so um, it's very cool. I just want them to have the best time, have fun, be loud and proud. I don't know how prominent the yodel is in other countries. Maybe this will catch on all over the world. We're live from Covent Garden searching for the person who will become the new yodel of Yahoo. Um, the winner of today's competition will also get to go on and sing with Pixie Lot, who's just been nominated the best newcomer by MTV, and Barry from the Fratelli. Have you ever done a yodel? Yahoo! And just express yourself, giving the yodel back to the people. Very confident work. is you don't actually have to yodel. I mean, you can kind of interpret it however. You could have your own yodel that you created, that you personalized on the Yahoo homepage. I think people should definitely go ahead and submit their yodels. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and you could become famous from this.